5 given the unit vector. So when it is mentioned the unit vector that we know that unit vector the magnitude is equal to 1. So how to calculate magnitude? So x square plus y square is equal to 1. So we know that this one the unit vector is given that Q, Q is equal to pi plus 8j divided by 70. So, to key in inside the formula of magnitude, we need to know what is our x and what is our y. So, we can separate this one. So, this one is p, pi over 73 plus 8j divided by 73. Where this one is third, p over 73i plus 8 over 73j. Right? If we can arrange it in this form, we know we can get that xi plus y. J. This is where we can get our x and y. So we know that this one, the magnitude is equal to 1. Why? Because this one is a unit vector. So this one is, so x square plus y square is equal to 1, right? So the value of x is equal to p divided by 73 square plus this one is 8 over 73 square is equal to 1. Now we bring set to the other side. So set is print to the other side. So here we get p square divide. So set, set 73 square. Set and square can be cancelled out. Divide by 73 plus this one is 64 divided by set 73 square. We get 73 is equal to 1 square. 1 square is actually 1. So here p square divided by 73 is equal to 1 square is 1 minus. So this one we bring to the other side. 64 divided by 73. So 73 minus 64, we get 9. 9 over 73. P square divided by 73. So we can cancel out. P square is equal to 9. P is equal to 9. So here we get positive, negative 3. 6 given that. So you see here this symbol means unit vector so we know unit vector you just use this formula so 1 minus k i plus h j express h in term of k so how can we relate h and k so this one we have this one is x and this one is y we know that here that x i plus y j so we know also that x square plus y square is equal to 1 so we can relate uh, k and h. So here x is 1 minus k square plus y is h, right? This one is h square is equal to 1. So we bring set to the other side. 1 minus k square plus h square is equal to 1 square, or just 1. So now we can expand this. So this one is 1 square, we get 1. 2 times negative k times 1, we get minus 2k. So, k square we get plus k square. So, this one just use the formula of a minus b square is equal to a square minus 2ab plus b square. So, the easy way is that you just square the first one and then 2 multiply negative b times a, you get the middle one and the last one you just square the back one. So, this is how I do it here. Okay, plus h square. 1 square is equal to 1. So, this one it wanted us to get h in term of k so we want h so everything else we bring to the right h square is equal to 1 so this one is positive 1 become negative 1 negative 2k become positive 2k and then k square positive k square become negative k square so 1 minus 1 is 0 right so this one is 0 so this one is 2k minus k square this one is h square. So, h is equal to positive negative. So, 2k minus k square. 